With the 250-pound warhead, the Martin Marietta-designed Bullpup air-to-surface missile was an operational device that required the pilot of the launching aircraft or a missile officer to use a small joystick for guiding the Bullpup down to its target. The Bullpup used bright flares mounted in its tail to give the pilot the ability to see the Bullpup's path as he aimed the missile into its target. Different iterations of Bullpup matured in the 1950s and 60s. This color film footage was made for a U.S. Navy training film in June and July 1965 aboard the aircraft carrier USS Coral Sea. The aircraft carrying bullpups in this film are Douglas A-4 Skyhawks. Several aircraft types were made bullpup capable in the U.S. Navy, Air Force, and the militaries of other nations. Some bullpups relied on a solid fuel rocket booster, others used a liquid-fueled motor. Warhead size increased over time and one Air Force version was enlarged to become nuclear capable. The need for the launch aircraft to remain behind the bullpup and essentially follow it down to the target while guiding it put the aircraft in some peril from anti-aircraft fire. At the end of this film, watch for the launch of F-8 Crusader jet fighters and an RF-8 photo variant of the Crusader.
This is Fred Johnson for the Air Rail Images channel. Thank you for watching and thanks especially for subscribing and giving this video a thumbs up.